Hello and welcome to Airtech Hunting. This morning we've got the beautiful Crown Mark II laminate out with us today. I'm going to quickly take it out in a hunt and then I'll take you through this gun. Sit back and enjoy. It was a scorching hot summer's morning here in Cape Town, but there was no wind, so it gave me the perfect opportunity to stretch the legs of this Crown Mark II. I strategically parked my truck overlooking these fences, and the distances were 50 meters all the way out to 100 meters to the wall at the back there. The sparrows were particularly fond of this fence, so I had ample targets to test on. I quickly memorized a few distance markers with the rangefinder and it was straight to action. <laughs> Down goes the first one, 73 meters. Yo, this thing is so smooth. This gun is configured to shoot the Javelin 23 grain dot 2 and 8 slug at 930 feet per second. It's an absolute laser. <laughs> 62 meters. Yo, this is awesome. <laughs> 68 meters. Awesome. He's down, nice loud thud. This gun is still factory standard and I'm really pushing the limits on it. I've got the hammer all the way maxed out. I've got the regulator and 160 bar and the transfer port all the way open. Seventy-three meters. This thing is an absolute laser, and I'm very surprised how smooth it is. Jeez. Straight down, sixty-three meters. Nice. That one twirled. Awesome. <laughs> 74 meters. Yo, I can do this all day long. So awesome. I've got the Element Optics Titan on the crown today and I'm using the Eagle Vision scope cam system. <laughs> that's a solid hit. Jeez, that's awesome. Hundred meters on the dot. Awesome. <laughs> I've got a few accessories on this gun and they include the Donny FL Koi silencer, the Accutech bipod and the Sabre tactical bottle clamp. A little bit closer, 60 meters. Another 100 meters, yeah. amazing. With no wind, the sun really beats down on you, but shots like that makes it all worth it. Yes, <laughs> it's a massive explosion. Yeah. 
Like with all FX triggers, this one is no exception. It's extremely good straight out of the box. Hundred meters on the dot again. Man, this is so, so nice. There's also a adjustable cheek piece and very comfortable rubber padding on this stock. <laughs> 84 meters, dead as a rock. The Crown utilizes the same side shot magazine as the Dreamline and Wildcat. Very nice touch effects. <laughs> that one made a little roll there on the ball. Awesome. There's also 20 MOA built in right into the Picatinny rail, something all air guns should have. 47 meters. Yes, that's loud. Underneath the gun you have access to your externally adjustable regulator and all your gauges. That was 86 meters. I don't know if I got him very good, but yeah, he went down straight away. The new STX Superior Liner also comes as standard now. <laughs> Down he goes. Another 85 meter shot. <laughs> 75 meters. Killed that starting. Well, that is it for today. I must be honest, I wasn't a big fan of the crown before today, but my mind has certainly been changed. I hope you enjoyed this episode. Please like and subscribe if you think I've earned it, and I will see you next time. Cheers. <laughs>